Hi everyone, Gary here from uh, Kiwi Fly Fisherman. It is four days left. <laughs> we have four days left of summer officially. It's a cracker of a day and you can see uh, Canterbury's had a bit of snow. This was kind of following tropical cyclone Gita that came through here. Most of the rivers are pretty chocolate brownie. So we're going to try lake fishing again today. Probably another half hour out from the lake. Thanks for coming along. What a primo day! I've got a surprise to show you soon. <laughs> here we are, Lake Self. Last time I was here, I had my dinghy out here. I've sold the dinghy! And, uh, yeah, I've moved up to something new, something different. What a beautiful day though, folks. Look at this. There's a rise down there. So I've upgraded to a kayak. This is the Dream Kayak from, I think it's called the Sparrowhawk 360. It's an Aussie kayak. I've had it for a week and this is the first time out. So 3.6 meters, 28 kgs without its seat and stuff. We're going to get it on the lake today and see if we can catch a few nice fish. There it is. Just need to get the seat on. What a beautiful kayak. So it's got a stadium seat that's going to go in here. You can see it's got a little wet keeper for the paddle. And uh, we'll put a little fish uh, rod holder there. Lots of packing space at the back, front. She's a beauty, folks. 3.6 meters. Can't wait to get out here. Lake Self. Looks like I'm the only one on this lake today. It's a beautiful day. Just looking west. I've just come from back there. There's a waterfall up ahead here. I see it running down the ravine from way up there. Just kind of meanders through and then comes out under the shingle bed here into the lake. This is what they call the hot spot in the lake. So we'll head across there. I've camped across over there before with a hammock. But there's no more camping allowed around uh, these lakes, unfortunately. Just, yeah, there's been a lovely rise. Um, not sure what uh, brown or rainbow, but a nice sized trout there. So I'm putting the spinner away and I'll get the fly out here, mate. That was a beautiful, beautiful sized fish.
the boat down the end there, I think. What a beautiful day. <laughs> That's a pity we can't camp around this lake anymore. So many beautiful spots. Oh, wow. Let's get that dry fly on this boy. Check in with you soon. It's time to go hang the hammock up down there. Put on a brew. There's a Sparrowhawk 360. Beautiful little kayak. Well, we're going to head back across that little peninsula over there and put the hammock up and put a brew on. Alright, let's have a cup of shall we? What a beautiful spot again. It's so sad we can't camp here man. Alright, now the lament what you haven't got. Be thankful for what you have got. Gold, hot chocolate, that's the one. <laughs> hey, no fish yet, everyone, but um, just enjoying the experience of the kayak. First time out in the water, and she's a beauty, working a treat. So, uh, yeah, thanks again for joining us on this beautiful day, Saturday. Pretty primo out here. Just a few flicks while we're waiting for the water to boil. Been a bit busy at work lately. We've been uh, able to get out too often. It's good to be out. happy with the kayak, very happy, very stable, 
they used to have a pedal ski back in the day <laughs> in South Africa. A wave ski, I think they call them. But it's first up. First time I'm owning a real kayak. I think that was weird. <laughs> So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get out a bit more with the kayak. I'm looking forward to taking it up to Lake Tennyson where we can camp up there. And I'll take you along. Really lovely, eh? sits up quite high as well so you can see fish quite easily. I did see that one taking, I think it could have been a cicada earlier. going on here. I did not, however, bring a spoon. <laughs> so I'll have to improvise. Improvisation. Sai Oasis mug with this little cozy around it. Keep the drinks nice and warm. Probably didn't need to put two hot chocolates in here, but hey, why not? Little titanium windscreen is really nice. Keeps the wind off the uh, denatured alcohol flame. There's complete fire bands around here in Canterbury, so brought the old tram gear burner along. Try and stick to the rules, which is good. Cheers.
Hey guys, if she could be here joining me, it's pretty awesome. Nice breeze. some better trees over there but uh, I'll show you why I didn't set up there stinky dead possum there he is it's his ribs there so I'm upwind of that in the old hammock Catching a primo view. Beautiful guys. There's a big fish out there, I don't know if you can catch one camera man, that thing's huge, wow, I've got a plan guys, I've got a plan.
Man, there was a big rise out there. Just there at those dark reeds out there. You can see it. I have got a plan. <clears throat> got a black gnat on you. I think that's what the boy will take. <clears throat> There's a big fish. No bones about that one. That's a big fish out there. Whoa! The lure would have gone past him there too, man. Look how far back he went up there. I think I need another 10, 15 feet on that time. Sixteen black net. All right, time to uh, head back out across the lake, back to the car. Have a few throws on the way. Ah, oh, it's nearly half past two. It's been a great day. Took a little bit of water over the front bow on the way across. But she handled well, guys. Mm. Almost back at the car. It's been a great trip. Thanks again for joining us. Take care, everybody. See you next time.